Now, of course, the first reactions that we've witnessed happen to be on social media, especially Twitter, where supporters of the independence express their happiness over this news, saying that Germany's decision only proves that the justice system in Germany is just unlike the Spanish one who's still keeping political prisoners. However, we've also seen um, the reactions of those who don't want independence who are expressing their sadness and saying that Germany's decision only proves that no one can know what's happening inside Catalonia unless they lived in it. They're saying that there should be somehow, some way for Bouchdemont to be charged for rebellion when he's back in Spain, even though Germany has already dismissed those charges. And what about demonstrations? Do you think those are a probability? Well, of course, um, this is something that we don't know still because we're waiting to see if there is any reaction on the street. Now, of course, we're still waiting to see if there will be any demonstrations for the people who don't want independence, who have been um, very quiet in the last few weeks over Bouchdemont's, um, the uh, news that came out that Bouchdemont was um, detained by Germany and such. But we're still waiting to see if that will happen anytime soon. Now, of course, the parliament has a session um, soon for the assignment of the president. So maybe... In that way, in this, in the, when that happens, there will be demonstrations, of course. Amara, what about the Catalan Parliament then? Where does this leave uh, everything there? Does that mean that they can actually vote for Puigdemont again to be president? Now, of course, Bouchdemont, in his case, it was the first time that he was actually able to vote in the parliament today again, and that was against the decision to remove the parliament's president Turin from his position. Now, of course, that does not mean that Bouchdemont can be back to be president again, but the pro-separatist parties are actually preparing a symbolic presidency for Bouchdemont while they are waiting to vote for Jordi Sanchez to be president. Now, get this. Jordi Sanchez is in prison still, and he was a candidate to be president before. He refused it over um, Madrid's threats to keep him imprisoned if he actually becomes president. Now, Jordi Sanchez is saying, I'm prepared to take on the role, especially because Madrid did not release him from prison after he refused that role. So in this case, we are just waiting to see if Jordi Sanchez will become president instead of Bouchdemont and if Madrid will actually respond to such news. All right. Who will become president? Mara, we'll have to leave it there. That was Mara Ryan for us in Barcelona. Thanks so much.